Hi, I'm Steve Anthony. I'm a handyman, a carpenter here in New York City. This clip, I'm going to show you how to use a Dremel tool. Dremel tool is a high-speed rotary cutting machine. It looks a little something like this. It's an amazingly versatile tool. It has a five-speed, uh, a five-position speed setting that uh, you can run the motor anywhere from uh, 5,000 to 30,000 RPM in the case of this particular model. They make various different models that have different capabilities as far as the RPM and the, the, the fittings that you can use, the attachments. Um, in this case, uh, I, I do have a, an attachment to show you. This is the basic tool with the basic setup. If you, uh, there's a motor in here, and this uh, collet, this is an eighth inch collet, and this is the, the, the spindle lock, so you can put on an attachment. In this case, this is a wire brush that uh, you can use for scraping rust off of uh, metal, for example. I can show you on this uh, metal table. We'll just take a little bit of the... So if you were going to want to repaint this and there was some rust flaking on there, you could easily grind it off with the, with the wire brush, prep the surface for paint. Uh, now if I wanted to remove this particular bit, simply take my wrench, get my spindle to lock, you turn it and you'll feel it snap into place. Loosen the collet, remove the bit. Now in this case I'm going to put in a router bit and this is a, uh, it's a rounding over bit. Tighten it nice and snug. You don't want it to come loose on you. It can be very dangerous spinning at high speeds. Now the router attachment, you simply remove this collar and replace it with this device, which is simply the uh, router attachment that Dremel makes for their tools. And uh, actually I'm going to have to lower the bit depth a little bit so I can demonstrate how this works. Okay. Put on the router attachment, and this will enable you to uh, you slide this up and down to change the depth of the cutter that you're using. In this case, we'll put it right there so we can put a nice round edge on this piece of wood. In the case of this demonstration, you can see I just did a rough rounding over. You want to work against the rotation of the tool so it doesn't pull your tool out of your hand. So you're sort of pushing against the rotation of the bit. That's just a basic overview of the Dremel tool. Uh, be sure when you're using it always to use safety glasses because of the high speed. If, if a bit should come loose or some chips of wood, they fly at you at very high speeds. Always wear eye protection. This is Steve Anthony. Thanks for watching.